Ground coming up in just a few minutes. An investigation is underway now after a Rocky Hill nursing home confirmed two cases of Legionnaire's disease. That's according to public health officials. Now, Legionnaire's is a type of pneumonia, and it is treatable with antibiotics, but there is an increased risk for older people with compromised immune systems. NBC Connecticut's Jamie Ratliff filed this report earlier tonight. Very concerned and on edge, yeah. Yeah, that's putting it mildly. Katie Garcia came to Apple Rehab in Rocky Hill to visit a friend recently transferred here and says she had no idea there was anything wrong until she read the news. We all became very concerned and went to the front desk and said, what is going on? How come we didn't know it? And she said, uh, patients and family were notified. Well, we weren't because we wouldn't have had him sent here. He wouldn't have come here. Today, the State Department of Public Health revealed two cases of Legionnaire's disease have been confirmed among residents of Apple Rehab and one patient recently died. The agency says it was no Notified last week a resident had the disease and that Legionella bacteria were also found in water samples. Facilities have to be very cautious about their water supply. Yes, they do have usually large water supplies. And if the conditions are right, especially in warm weather, the organism will thrive and can cause disease. Dr. Virginia Bielek, chief of infectious disease at the Hospital of Central Connecticut, says it's not transmitted person to person, but by breathing in water vapor, like when it's coming out of shower heads and sinks. DPH says the water system at Apple Rehab has undergone chlorine treatment and that further testing is underway. The facility released a statement saying the risk of getting sick from a building's water supply is very low, especially for healthy people. We are proactively monitoring patients with new symptoms. Contradicting DPH's report of two confirmed cases, Apple Rehab says they only have one. Garcia says her friend's family is discussing what their next steps should be and thinks there should be signs out front letting everyone know. So that they could make their own informed decision. Do I want to enter or do I not? Do I want my family member or loved one to come here right now? Jamie Ratliff, NBC Connecticut News. Now the State Department of Public Health say they will be monitoring Apple Rehab's water quality and disease prevention measures as well. A bloom